What's up, y'all? It's Piranha Head. And y'all wondering, where's this fish tank? This fish tank is getting a new background on it. Like, see this background back there? You look crazy in there, bro. The nine red bellies in there. I'm crazy, ain't that been out the tank before like this? This long. But, let's do this. Whoa, I'm gonna jump up. Sure. I had to put the top on there, but anyways, get your piece of paper, cut this, this is what I'm painting in the background, this and something else. Uh, you cut the paper to the shape that you want to be. I tried to make a piranha, so that's my piranha. And this is the tank. I cleaned it out, wiped it down. Got my windows open because I'm about to spray paint it with this uh, plastic dip. That's how I did the black background, but the black uh, background ain't bright enough so i'm about to put a little bit of red in there so that's the paper that i cut out right there piranha shape and just cut that out i started already it's gonna look something like that so that whole thing is gonna be red and this middle piece that i cut out too right here is gonna be red too all right on boom so it's gonna be a piranha there piranha there and i'm thinking about putting one there or somewhere around her i don't know i might just keep the two up top probably but this is what it's called Plastic dip, they come in all the colors, basically. Well, I only seen uh, at the Home Depot, I, or you get it from Home Depot. The Home Depot I got it from, uh, from is uh, black and red and white and a couple other colors. They ain't have to me of uh, all the colors for real, but like the regular spray paint is, but they had these, my favorite color is black and red. So I was cool with that. So not brown, this is black and silver, but I had black, silver and gray and Red is orange or whatever you want to call it. But it's gonna be the background right there. And I'm about done with this one right here. So peel this off. And they come off super easy too. Like all you gotta do is grab it. I'm like, oh you snatch. But look, uh, let me see when I start at. I start down here and you just rub it up like that. Take my thumb. Just rub it up. Cause I already cut it with a razor blade. I got all this stuff from Home Depot too. This is the razor blade I use right here. So you just go over the outline as you want. And then just rub it up. Or rub it down whichever whichever way you want to go. I'm just going up. And from the outline that I already made, it's coming straight off. You might have to go over with the blade again at certain spots because it might not have cut it good enough for it to roll off like this. So I'm gonna have to go over a couple of spots cause it ain't rolling straight off like it's supposed to. Oops, messed that up a little bit. But yeah, just roll everything off, roll straight off. This, if you don't want a background, that grassy looking, ocean looking one that you get from uh, Patco or any other pet store that you go to, those suck. They boring. I rather make my own background look way better and to make you feel good because you did it. Well, I'm gonna show y'all when I get done with the red. Oh, how I look. Burns over going crazy. But I'll come back and I'm gonna show y'all how it uh, look when I spray paint it in about a couple minutes or whatever. Right back. Stay tuned. So I started. And that's the first uh, coating of it. You'll have to do at least like three or four to make it look right. I'm gonna show y'all how I look in the inside. It's gonna be something like that. One front and down there, one front and up there. I decided not to put one down because I don't like cutting another one, honestly. And I think they'd be doing too much just to be cool right here. If I like this and I think it's good, I'm gonna do the big one like it too soon. I don't know when, because that tank is at 125 and it's kind of heavy. And I don't know if I'm gonna be up to doing that, but it's the first coat and it don't look that bad, honestly. Well, let that sit for a couple seconds and I'm gonna do the second coat. You know what, I really would just show y'all this over my nose, cause I am in my basement. And if you can do it outside, that'd be the best thing to do. But right now, I don't feel like taking this up these stairs. I just don't get any right now. So let's hit the second coat.
If you do do it in your house, just make sure you got something over your nose, man. Because this is painting. It ain't good to breathe in. If it's just a mask or anything, anything better than just breathing it straight in. I just hope one can is enough. So I only have one can. It should be, though, because there ain't a lot that I'm doing. When I was doing the uh, whole tank, on this one and my other 75 that I had before I sold that one, I used two cans on each tank. This should be enough, bro. Man, I think this is just way so much better than that stuff you get from Patco or any other fish store. Just doing it like this yourself. Like, if I was a real good artist, man, <laughs> This should come out like 10 times better. But I did it, so I'm gonna like it the way it go. So come out so good, man. That's about three coatings, I would say. I'm gonna chill for a second. And then I'm gonna come back and do it again. And I use this duct, this, uh, this, what is this called? It's called a paint tape or something like that to hold my uh, picture down to make the cutouts. With this right here, a little squirt down, I just freestyled that. I want nobody to go freestyle them piranhas though. But yeah, I just finally put the top on the piranhas. They were going a little crazy. I started putting them over the big boy, but I changed my mind. Let me open this one up. They're back there going crazy, man. I gotta get ready to go to the grocery store, get some food, because it's grocery shopping day. Mondays, which sometimes Saturdays and Sundays, but, and I got the laundry too. Yesterday was laundry day, but so busy and I worked seven days so picking up extra hours so all right I'm gonna spray one more time and I'm gonna uh, come back later when I get completely done with it and show y'all how I look because I ain't gonna bore y'all to death all right stay tuned all right y'all just got done finished uh, spray painting it and this is how I look all right, I'm about to turn around so I can see exactly how it look and how good it look. All right, y'all, here she goes. That's how it look. TV kid video. I'll tell me y'all thoughts, how it come out. Did it come out good? Did it come out bad? I think it came out perfect. I like the way it look. Look real good. Exactly how I wanted it to be. All right, piranha head. Peace out. Thanks for watching.